Hello my beautiful creative people, this is Nairi from Creative Kingfisher and I'm going to be redating my little skinny planner sheets here because I want to make a list of things that I want to do around the house mainly because I guess yeah those are the things that perhaps don't always get done I'm not going to say it's terrible but it could be better so I've got these Peaches and Pine Studio stickers which are quite small which will work really well for for here I think as well so I hope you guys are doing good thank you for joining me if you're if you're used to joining me then hello welcome back if you're new then hello so there's lots of nice stickers that we can use here and I think that these are not going to get lost on these pages so let me just have a look at the orange in here see which one I might want to go for I don't want to lose. I don't want to lose the the depth of colour on the other stickers. So I wonder whether brown might be a better idea. Let me see. These are red, aren't they? Yes, they are. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Right. I did use some browns the other day. I do quite like the deep brown. So. Yeah, I'm going to go for the deep brown. I'm going to try to keep my books laid out today and not keep shutting them. As I said before in my other video, space is a little bit of an issue in my little lovely little crafty room. Let's put this in here. So, being a busy girl, I'm going to take it a little bit more chill today if people will allow me to. You know what I'm saying? People will leave me. I will be in here creating. I'm going to do this spread. I'm going to do another one. I think two is enough in one row for me. I get a little bit, you know, I, I kind of then end up getting a bit slapdash with it. So I've got my two spreads and I've been doing some more painting, which is very exciting because I actually feel like. I've really wanted to paint, which means I'll be getting ahead of myself with the next sticker book, yes. But even if I don't, I've enjoyed the painting, even if I kind of, you know, don't make it into anything. I know I will, but even if I didn't, I've been enjoying it. So uh, my first sticker book is, is very much images that are more suitable for spring and summer. So I anticipate to release Ready for the Spring and Summer, the first sticker book. So it's not going to happen before Christmas and I'll get my website ready and then probably get it all on there late Feb, I reckon. But then I would be thinking about an autumn, fall kind of release toward the end of the summer and those are the images that I'm working currently on. So it's very exciting, everybody. Very exciting. And my unique selling point will be the fact that there'll be a picture of me as the artist on the back of the sticker book and that every image will be having been hand-painted by, by me. Okay, so that's the start of the redating. We can come back to the July bit in a minute. Clearly it's not July, so let's move things around. Let's have a look at these. Pumpkin Spice, this is called, by Peaches and Pine Studio. I think we're ready to go for pumpkins. We're definitely in that time of year, aren't we? Now then. Important to do. So I think I am going to put some quite functional things in. I think all of those colours would be absolutely fine. So let's have to do every other day. This is gonna this spread's gonna look different from what I normally do. Normally um it's lots of decorative with boxes added in, kind of as a a side sort really, but I think I'm gonna be concentrating a bit more on how I'm gonna create this list. So I saw a really interesting video this morning when I was trying to wake myself up about organising the home and some of it I thought was unrealistic really 
if I'm honest, but some of it was quite good. Mm. Do you know what? I'm going to leave it, guys. I know it's the cardinal sin. So if you're new here, I don't always put wonky stickers on. Occasionally I do. But I know that for a planner on camera, it is the cardinal sin. I'm really sorry. Let's put that one over there. Make sure this one's straight, hey? Uh, where was I going? What was I telling you? Yes, organising the home. Some of it was quite clever, what she was saying. Some of it, I kind of know, but I don't do it. Things like if you have a very busy drawer in the house. Now these are nice, aren't they? I mean, I could use Mojo Jojo's uh, ones, because she has them as well. So maybe I'll make that decision in a minute. Let's get some of the juicy stickers in, shall we? I love that with the cups there. Got one of these in. I'm going to do a little cluster down here because I don't need every single little space on here, but I do. I don't want to put so much decorative in that we can't actually make this work as for what I want it to be. Let's keep going. So she was saying things like, um, in, in a busy drawer, you have little containers within that drawer and she doesn't spend any money on it, she just uses shoe boxes and stuff like that. And I kind of do do that a little bit, but not as much as I could do. So she's given me a few ideas around the house. I'm not going to do that today. I might concentrate on doing some stuff over the weekend make a bit of progress and this is what this list will be put on here which areas of the house I want to sort out and she was also saying don't get overwhelmed don't try and do too much in one go and that definitely makes sense right let me see I don't want too many big stickers in there we go I've just put another video up for Weight Off Your Mind, which is my weight loss channel, explaining how September's not been such a good month for weight loss. I think I'm doing all right though. I'm still losing. These flowers are cute, aren't they? I am still losing. I think I'm happy with that, being that I've not been able to track quite as well as what I normally would. Okay, now I'm gonna use some of these underneath. Brightens it up doesn't it? I'm quite having fun with this more functional thing I think. Used to do a bit more functional back in the day on the channel but it's been a lot more decorative recently. Decorative is kind of the way I normally go if I'm honest with you because it's what I enjoy more being. I think I'm very creative with my art and stuff so I think I like to see something come together almost like a, a, a picture when I'm doing it. I like it to look like a almost like a real scene. Right, that is nice. I think I like that a lot. Put another one there. So yeah, this will be purely for organising the house. Because on my catch-all panel I probably wouldn't do it as much. I don't write loads on my catch-all panel, I just write the main things that I need to remember. Mm. I wonder whether these could be like little tick offs, these bows. I think I'll put those on as well. Maybe I'll do those every other day though, because that's where I've got the to do's. I could like tick off each thing that I do on underneath those bows. Does that make sense? So if I have, I don't know, say five things I want to do that day, I just scatter them on there. I can take them off. I think that's how I'm going to use that. I hope that makes sense to you. Do you have checklists, guys? If, if, if you're watching me, do you you stick them in your planner, or do you, realistically do you actually have them separate from your planner? Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually put this in one of the planners. I know it's only small. It's going to go in a, in one of my big planners, but. 
I am going to slot it in to my catch-all. Let me see, every other day is realistic. But no, I'm not going to spend every day doing this. So every other, the checklist is fine. I think we can have a little bit more decorative down the bottom, see what we've got. Right, loving that fireplace there. To be honest, they're all nice, aren't they? I want something to go with the other sticker that I've got, so I'm choosing the one with some food on it. <laughs> How ironic is that? There we go. Yeah, I don't think my weight loss channel is gonna do very well, guys. It's, it's, it's okay. I mean, every channel starts off really slowly. And unless you share it out to lots of social media, it kind of often falls dead in the water. And the ones videos that have done well are ones that I've shared on Facebook. And to be honest, people that have got connection with me have been watching them. But I wanted YouTube to do that job for me. Now then. I am going to... Use the cleanup sticker. Here. That just went over the edge there, didn't it? Can I get that off? Yeah, so as I was saying, I don't think, I mean, I wanted to record, record my weight loss journey because I am of a certain age where it's really hard to lose weight, because I have a health condition and and then ended up with more health, you know, health things happening. And I wanted people just to benefit from seeing what I was doing, really. It wasn't really going to ever set the world on fire, you know. But then there were a few of you guys who watched this, who started following me, which was really lovely and very encouraging. And I could tell that you were being encouraged by it, especially if you were thinking about losing weight, even if you weren't necessarily on that journey yet or you know totally serious about it but you were interested shall we say that's nice isn't it i feel like shall, dare i say it some florals are going to be needed Let me have a look. okay i found seasonal basics and i'm not sure it's actually got florals in it but it does have the right colors that match with these these stickers these words are all going to be a bit big i think the quotes i don't i don't need i'm not doing a bucket list am i I tell you what, let's try and get some of these in, shall we? Because the blue is picking up on the blue. I'm sure you will agree. And the pinky brown is picking up on the brown. So there's limited amounts of these though. That one's gonna go straight in the middle. I need to get myself a new crocodile punch because I've absolutely wrecked. Yes, I have wrecked my other one. When I was trying to do DIY planner, I'm afraid things went a bit pear shaped. Pumpkin shaped is what they went. Can I get away with that? I'm doing it, I'm doing it. I kind of can't get away with that, but I have, you know. It's probably going a bit silly, but this is what happens, isn't it? You see an idea, you want to do it, you realise you don't really have enough space, but you do it anyway. Right, that one can kind of go across there. I feel like when this is chopped in half, you'll see that that has actually had a good effect, and these stickers are nice, I really like them. Um, I was talking about my weight loss channel, was night, and then I got very distracted. Yeah. When I look at other weight loss channels or other people, don't worry, I'm not comparing myself, but the competition for it is with people that have stripped off, you know, down to their very minimal clothing and are much younger. And so therefore, when you see 
the kind of like the front of the video you see very attractive people with not a lot on. I can't compete with that guys. If I cut that down the middle I think that might be, I just wanted something in there if I could but I don't think this bow can fit in, we'll see. So I don't think I can make the channel, can I get that in there? You know, if I'd moved that, those pumpkins up, that would have been sensible, wouldn't it? Should I see if I can do that? I don't think I can compete with it, really. So what I'll do is I'll, I'll keep putting videos on until I get down to my target weight. No, that's going to rip. Tell you what, let's not. Let's put that up there. I might just have to accept that it is what it is, you know? Because it wasn't thought through. I'll tell you what, we'll cut the slippers in half and we'll see. Yeah, so I'll keep putting it on. I've lost £32. I'll just keep going until I've got where I believe my target weight to be. Record how I've been getting on, what I've been eating and, you know, my exercise and stuff. And then if it if it catches on, it does. If it doesn't, then it was nice for some people to watch, wasn't it, I guess. And... Uh, sometimes it's best not to think about it too much I just wanted to share and the thing is is when you've got lots of different sort of hobbies and things you want to share you can't put them all on one channel because people don't want to see that you guys want to see me try to fit things in I can't fit in which I can't it's gonna have to go over there now and that's gonna have to go over there that didn't work I couldn't get it in I'm just going to have to accept that gap's going to be there. So I'm going to cut down the middle. And as you can see, this is going to be a fun little listy week for me to write in. I look forward to writing in that. I'm going to film a vertical spread in a minute, which, let's be honest, is most people's favourites. That's what I've discovered. Loads of people like vertical. Although I was watching Steph the other day and she was making me smile because two of her patrons, Patreons had asked her to do. I'm going to have to cut it this way, guys. And I know that's not very professional, but to get it on the discs, I'm going to have to. You can do the same, to be honest. If you're new and you don't have a punch and you can't afford one, just use some scissors. Just be very careful that you don't overcut. You can do it this way, it's fine. She really doesn't like vertical and, and she was struggling with vertical. She's always a dashboard person and I dashboard is my favourite but I love decorating a vertical. I really enjoy doing a vertical. Right, how are we doing? Get rid of that. We haven't changed the July yet. I'm sure I can hear you shouting, possibly even screaming at the camera. Don't put that in your October planner because it says July. So we also didn't put any days in. So let's do that in a minute. I just wanted to show you what I was doing here. If you've never seen somebody do this in a naughty way. We've got glorious sunshine today, would you believe? It's cold, but it's it's beautifully sunny. Right, okay, let's get... Shall I try using those days of the week? I think they might be a little bit on the bright side, but I think it'll make a nice change from... I normally use JoJo's functional ones for days of the week, but these are going to fit in, aren't they? They're going to cover up everything, are they? Let me see. Hmm. They're actually going to cover up the brown. I don't want that, so I will go back to Jojo. Let's get them off, shall we? Got a glass of painting painting water back there, which is hovering dangerously close to everything. Monday. So I don't know if any of you have heard, but there's a quite, well, I think 12, 13 of us doing a collab on Instagram for breast cancer awareness that's coming up on the week between the 17th and the 24th and I'll be doing mine on YouTube as well so you'll see my spread and it's oh, 
as far as I can work out from what people are saying, it's monochromatic, which means it's entirely pink. I don't know if I've got that many entirely pink stickers, if I'm honest. I do have um, some breast cancer awareness pages to use though, so I'll do my best to be completely pink. But if not, then I'll have to get as close as I can to it. I don't know if you've had anybody that has suffered from breast cancer, but I've known quite a few women and uh, I think it's a brilliant a brilliant idea to come together as, as planners to do it actually. I'm quite excited about it. I'm not excited about learning how to share everybody's on Instagram and getting myself in an absolute befuddle. I'm one of these unusual people that prefers YouTube to Instagram. So uh, I feel more com comfortable on here, but I'm sure I'll, I'll pick it up as we're going along. Now then, that looks really nice, I think. So let's get a nice tab for July. Getting warmer in here. I'll just take my jumper off in a minute. Can I fit that on? Just. I'd say just. Mm, that was a fail. Let's try again, shall we? I think every planner's nightmare on YouTube, correct me if I'm wrong, anybody watching who does videos, is just knowing that you need to get them straight. And if you don't, you'll be peeling them off. And when you do, you're probably going to rip your planner. This is the thing. I don't know that that's much better. But I'm gonna do a contrast in the October and I'm going to put a dark brown October in. I love the dark brown in here, I've used it before. So, got October in, there we go, it's coming, it's coming, there. Okay, hope you've enjoyed that guys, please subscribe if you have and check out my channel and I will see you on Creative Kingfisher, thank you.